Hello fellow Peanuts fans, I'm Karen from CollectPeanuts.com. Today we're going to take a look at the Snoopy Ice Hockey Kit. This is the new one. This is the old one. The old one is from Monogram Mattel. And the new one is by Atlantis. Now the great thing about this kit is it uses the exact same mold as the original. Which is so terrific, I can't even tell you. The old kits... There isn't even a kit in here, but these old kits can go for $100 complete and even more depending on which one it is. And luckily this one is just $30. It's so amazing. Plus, Atlantis is going to be coming out with Snoopy and the Sapper Camel plus the Red Baron because you gotta have the Red Baron with Snoopy. So today we're going to look at how to build this kit, see how it goes together. It's a snap tight kit, so you don't need any glue, you just put it all together and have some fun. I'll also have a link down below to where you can buy this kit. Let's get building! Here we are looking at the inside of the model kit. We've got all of our pieces here, we've got Woodstock, we've got Snoopy, the hockey goal, we've got the bird bath base directions, a teeny tiny spring, all the decals, and of course, hockey pucks. I am going to put these aside for now. And I've also got a cup of hot cocoa. <sighs> Don't want to work without some cocoa. All right, let's take you through the directions. So, first it says place the support onto the base. So this is not the base. <laughs> this is the base. And go, this goes this way up, just like that. And then we take this bit and put it in here, give it a little turn so it locks into place, that's just one piece now. Next, we've got the, the gear system here. And this bit of the gear. And then this, uh, I think it's like a gearbox. Yep, gearbox. Now all these pieces are numbered. Sometimes they're numbered on the plastic, sometimes they're numbered on the piece. Like this one says five right there and it coordinates with the directions. So it should be easy to put together. The directions say to put some petroleum jelly on these pieces. Hope lubricate it. Um, I'm not exactly sure what it, supposed to be lubricated here but we're just gonna slather just a little bit on just a little bit don't want it too messy this gear goes into this hole this rod seems to go through this hole here I don't know which one's supposed to go in first. Maybe it's num numbered for a reason. Let's try this one, then this one. Now, you can see that turning the gear. Now there's a cover for this. Let's just snap that off. And you shouldn't need any like special tools to do this. Um, if you want, you can get an X-Acto knife and you can take off like these little bits where it's connected if you want it to look really clean and polished. But you probably don't have to do that on most of the pieces. Okay. Let's 
So let's to lubricate this bitch. <laughs> That's a lot. Let's see. There's little tabs here. Okay, these these tabs slip in. And then that snaps right in. Just like that. And it, it's pretty stuck in there now, so you want to make sure it's fully lubricated the way you want it before you get it in there. It's, it's quite nice that it just snaps together. So it looks for, like for number three, we're building the trigger in the middle. So we're going to need the number 10 arm. Here it is. Snap that right out. I keep thinking this is a hockey puck, but it's the trigger. Your finger goes in here and you control Woodstock. Okay. We've got this piece here and this piece. So this goes in here somehow. And to trigger lubricate. Go, just like that. Feels good. Okay, I was supposed to put this together while it was on the hockey rink. through here right and <laughs> there are a couple of little pegs right here to keep you in line that's the right hole let's look at the diagram sure Okay, that, that seems to be what we're meant to do. There must be something that connects that in. Let's look inside. This is the first time I'm building this, so I don't know all the ins and outs yet. Okay. Important, be sure this side is up. Okay, we're gonna make sure we do this right. We've got this bit. This goes through here. There's a big slit here. And then this goes in the middle. Now there's a number nine center pin. There's the number nine right there. Let's pull off the center pin. There we go. The directions make it look a little more complex than it actually is, but they're just trying to walk you through it. Okay, number five. Uh, we're putting in this spring, and there is a number 11 retainer, so let's get that. It's this little tiny piece right here. Okay, this goes in this arm here goes it on to this little platform here. So this needs to be all the way to this edge. Then this spring goes over that. Oh, first fasten the spring to the side of the bowl. So let's, let's follow the directions. what this little retainer clip is. Oh. 
lubrication. Don't forget that. This might be easier with, instead of a, using like a finger, use a Q-tip. Something like that. Now this retainer is firmly into the side of the bowl. Now I should be able to get the other end of this spring over this arm. There we go. Just need to give it a little twist. Got it right in there. Easy peasy. Okay, I think that's it for this page. Number six. Oh, we're getting to the top of the hockey rink here. And one nice feature that I'm noticing about this kit is you can see clearly on here that it says 2020 Peanuts Worldwide on it. So you know this isn't going to be the original kit. So if you're, you find this like in an antique store or something, you know to look underneath the hockey rink to see if it's new or old. Because we love reproductions, but at the same time, you don't like having to pay original prices for something that's just a reproduction. All right, we've got a hockey goal net. Also got these decals. Let's put those on first. Okay. Decal D. And you probably can't see this, but there are little tiny lines on the hockey rink here, so you know where to line them up. See if you can see that there. Just follow the directions and get these stickers on. Okay, now that the stickers are on, I can put on the goal. There we go, snaps into place. Number seven, here we go. It says first fit this tab into this slot. So this tab by the hockey goal goes into this slot here. There's like a little arrow here to make it easy to figure out which one goes first. We just need to actually get that in that little spot. There we go. Important peek through this slot to be sure center pin goes into center hole on oh. Let's hope it went. It did go in there. I don't think I'll be able to show that on camera, but it did go in. Next up, number eight, getting Snoopy put together. We've got these two pieces here. Let's 
and that one comes off. I really like how these uh, pieces are molded. Pretty good. There's the stocking cap. Look at that. These pieces are numbered on the actual piece. Okay, I don't think that's gonna stick as it is. Snoopy's nose in place. Oh, here we go. Here's his nose. Of course, it's black. Okay, don't don't take off this little arm here. This is how his nose attaches. Okay. Snaps into this one. Yep. There's a little retainer here. So this little peg goes into this little hole. If it looks like sometimes I'm really bad at putting these together, it's because sometimes I'm doing it through a camera lens rather than right in front of my face. That makes it a lot more difficult. Let's see, 18. This will go on his head here. It says first press Snoopy's nose into body half, snap body halves 12 and 13 together. Snap them all together at once. Oh. You gotta make sure you get both of these pins going in at the same time. There we go. Snap. Do the, the decals first. It's probably easier to manipulate these stickers when there isn't the cap on. This collar here is probably going to be the tricky one. It's the best place to start this. enough for like a little overlap so keep it nicely retained around his neck there we go that was the one I was worried about it went pretty easy hockey stick decal a Now these are just vinyl stickers, so if you need to reposition them, they will be easy to reposition. Um, like this this first hockey stick one I did, I, um, I think I might move that because it's just a little off. You don't want to endlessly be repositioning them, but getting them just right should be easy enough to do. I think the old kit was probably 
paper stickers. And if anybody knows, those, those just shred when you try, try and pull them off. It's the perfectionist in me coming out. All right, there's Snoopy with his stickers. Let's have a little drink. I'm using a vintage 1970s Snoopy's game mug. Now his cap. Closer to his head. Go. Easy as that. Okay. And let's do Woodstock here. stickers on his hockey stick. There we go. That's it for the decals. Now we've got Snoopy and we've got Woodstar. Let's take a look. All right, number nine. these characters placed in here and this Snoopy is actually like a half moon so if you just just look at it you'll figure out which way to do it <laughs> all right Woodstock is also a half moon there we go there's Snoopy Just move him up just a little bit. There we go. And then Woodstock. How do I do this? Here we go. There is a trigger here. And all you do is... Oh, and now I've done it. And then you just break it and then you have to pull it apart. <laughs> After looking inside... I noticed I had broken the little pin at the end of the trigger that goes above the arm area. So because of that, the trigger kept falling out of the arm. So instead, I made my own retaining clip for the end of the trigger and it's working beautifully now. Be careful with those plastic parts. Do you know how to play hockey? Do you want to be Snoopy or Woodstock? I seem to be Snoopy. I can't even, I can't even see it from this angle. I, he can't reach it. I know. You have to like, you have to like place it. Mm. 
But I don't know, like, does it have to be in the goal? The goal? Oh. I know what we can do. I, I'll go for Snoopy for this round and then you'll... And then we'll just turn around. Well, once you get a goal, then we switch, right? <laughs> Did I bounce it out of there? Yeah. Oh, you know, that was a soccer goalkeeper, so that's why I'm so good. <laughs> Just when I wasn't watching. Thanks for joining us for the Snoopy Ice Hockey Game. Special thanks to Atlantis for sending this along to share with my fellow Peanuts fans. Get one for your collection at the link down below. Plus, subscribe to my channel for the Snoopy and Red Baron release. While you're waiting, check out more Peanuts goodies at collectpeanuts.com, Facebook, and Instagram. Support this channel on our Patreon page and keep these videos coming. Have a great day. Bye. <laughs> oh, it's like I can't reach it there. The goal was open. That was kind of in. Are we calling that in or? Let me just set up my shot here. Like I'm trying to do this with any skill. Maybe, maybe it's easier going... <laughs> Where's Molly going? Oh! Gotcha. Good game. Good game. <laughs> We're so bad at this. Good.